first film from Northern Korea since the Russian occupation began in August of 1945. Scenes made by Soviet cameramen for showing to the Russian people. In the Soviet film report. Shown here are Korean students in a Russian medical school. Also sent to Russia for studies are young engineers and technical workers of all kinds who are scheduled to form the basis of the new economy of Northern Korea. Groups of cultural leaders visited Moscow last winter. Their tour included the ruins of Stalingrad and the showplaces of Russian industry, science and arts. Now return to Korea, the cultural ambassadors tour the country telling the story of Russian achievements and extolling the merits of the Soviet system. The Red Army governs its zone through the People's Committee of Northern Korea. Them is the feeding of Northern Korea. But the main agricultural areas in the south are under American control. The land in the north is infertile. The peasants were backward in their methods with no modern tools available. They've been encouraged to greater efforts by a land reform. The farms they once worked for Japanese masters are divided up and title given to the peasants who work the land. But if Northern Korea is poor in agriculture, it's comparatively rich in industry. Mountain streams were harnessed by the Japanese for electrical power, and these installations now belong to the new regime. <laughs>